Let's take a look at how playlists work, how you create a playlist, and the settings that are related to both creating your playlists and afterwards doing uh, editing of your playlist. The first thing we want to do is hit the playlist. Uh, you have the option of creating your playlist from scratch or you can use one of our templates. In this scenario we will try creating one from scratch. So the first thing is adding a name to your playlist. Then you have multiple aspect ratios you can choose from. Uh, the TV itself is the uh, is the factor defining what aspect ratio you should choose. And as you can see, these predefined aspect ratios both offer you a horizontal or a vertical layout. The next section is predefined layouts, or also known as zones. We offer a, a couple of predefined zone setups. You can of course read more or see the video about zones if you are creating content for multiple zones. In the advanced section you have the option of putting in your own aspect ratio. So if you have a TV that is a different aspect ratio than the ones we have uh, predefined, you can put in your own. Also you can activate randomized slides when you've done all your settings, you simply hit create. So when the playlists have been created, you'll see um, a preview, you'll see a name of the playlist, you'll see the duration of the playlist, how many slides, and the aspect ratio of your playlist. And just below, you'll find the edit playlist, you'll find the share playlist, you can add music to your playlist, and the green rocket is your publish button uh, and you'll find that guy uh, all over the system. If we hit settings, you see that you have an extra option of picking a level for whom can rearrange your objects on your canvas. Uh, in some cases, corporations have designs uh, and in those designs they have elements that they don't want um, rearranged or moved or even deleted. This is also the place where you clone or you remove your playlist. When you're done, simply hit save. That's it. I hope this was helpful. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out using our live chat on playsignish.com. Thank you.